right, so this is a tutorial on how to use the new Touch Engine FFGL plugin. Uh, it's pretty simple. Once you've downloaded the DLLs, you will need to place both of them in a plugins directory referenced by Resolume. In my case, I have gone ahead and set up a custom directory with my plugins, but you can do this however you want. So under sources, you can now find the Touch Engine plugin. I'm going to go ahead and drag it up. I'm going to go ahead and click open under tox file and included there is a test file called noise out only one param and this basically shows how the actual system works. Nothing will happen until it's activated. Once this is activated it will begin the process of loading the touch engine. This only needs to happen at the very beginning. Once it's loaded everything will work instantaneously. So as you can see I now have this texture coming through from touch engine uh, and you can see that it's exposed this float value so now if I go ahead and move these float values back and forth you can see it manipulating from touch engine itself. Now in order to set this up all you have to do is expose the parameters from touch designer in the talks and they will appear here. It currently supports floats, ints, strings, bools, and switches uh, in accordance with what FFGL floats. If there's any questions or any issues, please file them as tickets on the GitHub repo.